something special is going to happen today. Let me guess. We are going to be captured and sent away forever. What? No, Genio. We are going to meet new friends. I love meeting new friends, but I'm a little worried that Geo is foreshadowing. Let's figure out what that meant. Hey, Judah, come and look at these cool new robots. Okay, oh, uh, let me put the in the Hey, go put my way. Stupid robots. Kids are supposed to play with pets, not robots. This is Pip and this is Pop. Whoa, these look really cool. Hey guys, time to leave for school. Can you say goodbye to the robots and put them away? Okay, goodbye. I can't wait to play with the robots at your school. They used to say goodbye to me before they left for school. Now all they care about is their robots. Oh, and Corwin, uh, did you finish packing those shirts into that box? I'm going to be taking it to the post office later today. It's all packed. Awesome. And don't forget anything at school today. They're going to be fumigating the school to deal with a pest problem. The doors will be locked at the end of the school day and there will be no way to get in. Enjoy meeting the other robots. Hello, you must be new. We are. I'm Pip and this is my brother Pop. Hello. Pop, pop, pop. Like the sound that missiles make when they explode. I guess so. It's nice to meet you. It's nice to meet you too. I love going to new places and making new friends. We love making new friends also. Do you two have any cool abilities? Well, we have different sensors like light sensors and motion sensors. And I can fling rocks with my tire. What about any weapons? How do you protect yourself? I didn't realize we needed weapons. Is this place dangerous? Ignore him. You don't need weapons. Yeah, this place is safe. The only one around here now is Sherman the Hamster. And he loves robots. I hate robots. I need to figure out how to get rid of those robots so the kids will play with me more. Hmm. I need a plan. Didn't the dad say he was going to mail the box later today? If I can get the robots into that box, they will be mailed away from here. I'll just sneak out of this cage. I have an idea. Since we are getting to know you new robots, let's do an icebreaker. What is an icebreaker? It's when we drive one at a time onto a sheet of ice and see how long we can last before the ice breaks. Icebreakers are boring. Let's play hide and seek. I love icebreakers! Geo, this time don't shoot the ice right when we get on. The ice was attacking me with cold. I had to defend myself. So what now? We see how long we can stay on this ice. This is my chance. Vector was right about icebreakers. I tried to tell you. Are you ready for hide and seek? What if we get out of the slime machine and play in slime? The off button is broken on the slime machine. If that turns on, it will never stop making slime. Hide and seek sounds fun. If we're not doing this anymore, I'm shooting the ice. Ah, ow! Hey, where are the others? They must have already started playing hide and seek. Let's see if we can find them. Well, at least we had a soft landing on these shirts. Where are we? Where are Kip and Pop? Stay alert, everyone. We are in an unknown location, and our friends may have been captured. You are so dramatic, Gio. Nobody has been captured. You have all been captured! Who said that? It is I, Sherman the Hamster. I just captured you in this box and you are about to be mailed away from here. But you're a friendly hamster. Why are you doing this? Kids should play with pets.
pets, not robots. I'm tired of the kids playing with you instead of me. With all of you out of the way, the kids will have to play with me. <laughs> Quick, let's hide before the hamster realizes we aren't in the box. Now where is that box? Oh, here it is. Time to tape it up, take it to the post office, and mail it. Ah. Oh yeah, this is my favorite song. Get us out of here. He's taking the box. What do we do? Let's follow him and hopefully we can figure something out. Oh no, we're too late. I was really starting to like our new robot friends. <laughs> oh guys, I think we are about to be mailed. I'm already a male. This is horrible. The dad just took the box of our robot friends to the post office. We'll never see them again. There must be something we can do. Remember, Sherman the hamster doesn't know we're not in the box with the other robots. <laughs> now that I got rid of those robots, the kids will have to play with me now instead of the robots. Pets rule, robots drool. Uh-oh, I forgot my wallet. I better go back and get it. He's coming home! Now we just have to tell the dad about the robots inside the box! Hey! Hey! Look down here! He can't hear us with his headphones on! You're right. Let's just try to get the box out of the car. How are we going to do that? We're too short to open a car door. Could those scissors over there help? I don't think so. Any other ideas? I know! I can fling rocks with my tire! How is that going to help? The box is in the back of the car. The door on the back of the car is a button you press to open it. Oh, I get it. If you can hit the button with a rock, it will open. Exactly. There's the button. Here it goes. Wow, you have good aim. Let's move the box to the side, just in case the dad doesn't see us and tries to drive the car backwards. We did it! We saved our robot friends! Not so fast! You're just about to go in that box with your other friends! Quick! Pip, shoot some rocks at him! Now I see why Geo asked if we had any weapons. The hamster ball is too strong. It's like a force field. He's coming at us. Get out of the way! Let's just get back inside. We can't free the robots now with that hamster rolling at us. I think we lost the hamster. I sure wish I could visit somewhere nice and relaxing about now. We don't have time for that. We still have to save those robots. I know. Hey, it's a quadcopter. Maybe he can help. Quadcopter, come down here. Yes. Sherman the hamster has kidnapped most of the robots. He wants the kids to play with pets more instead of the robots. Sounds tough, but what does it have to do with me? I'm not a pet or a robot. Can you help save the other robots? Since you can fly around, the hamster won't be able to roll at you. Sorry, but I have to get to work. I deliver packages to people who order things online. He sure was in a hurry. Well, let's just keep thinking. How can we get past the hamster to get to the robots? No need to keep thinking! I'll take you right to the other robots and trap you in the box as well! Oh no! 
There's something I just don't understand. Oh, what do you mean? The kids aren't even around to play with you anyway. Once you get rid of us robots, you'll just be alone all day when the kids are at school. I may have a small brain, but I'm not stupid. I've got a plan for that, too. What are you planning? I'm going to destroy the school! I knew I should have attached my box cutting missiles today. So you've kidnapped the other robots, and now you're planning on destroying the school? That's right, Bop! How could you possibly destroy the school? You're just a hamster. I've actually been planning this for months! Haven't you heard about the robot slime machine? Botsy's mentioned it, but Vector said it's broken. The off button doesn't work. Once it turns on, it will never stop. Who do you think broke it? It was me! If I turn on the slime machine in the school, the entire building will fill with slime! So what? Slime is almost impossible to clean, so the school will have to close for good! The kids won't be able to go to school, so they will spend all their time playing with me! I won't have to compete with the other robots, and I won't have to compete with school! <laughs> That's insane! I'm putting you two in the box of robots, and then I'm going straight to the school with the slime machine. You better go quick. They're fumigating the school today, and the doors will be completely locked soon. You won't be able to get in with the slime machine. Oh, yeah. I do remember the dad saying that. Well, you're stuck here now anyways. I'm going straight to the school, and I'll deal with you two later. Why did you remind him that the school doors were locking soon? If he took us to that box, I don't think we could escape. We'd be done for. This net will be way easier to escape from. We just need to get out of this net, and then we can try to stop Sherman from sliming the school. But how are we going to get out of this net? Remember those scissors we saw on the ground outside? Yeah. I grabbed them. You're a genius! I had a feeling those scissors would come in handy. But now, how are we going to stop Sherman? We don't even know how to get to the school. Did you say you needed to know how to get to the school? I thought you were going to work. I'm just about to leave. I just had to get my uniform on first. Wait a minute. Did you see us tied up? Yeah. And you didn't try to save us? Hey. I told you this robot pet feud has nothing to do with me. I don't want to get involved. But you'll tell us how to get to the school? Sure. Leave the house and go north. Go over a bridge and afterwards turn right and you'll see the school up ahead. Thanks. Let's get going. I hope we're not too late. How are we going to stop the slime machine once we get to the school? We'll have to figure that out when we get there. We made it to the bridge. Just past this bridge and we'll be at the school. Wow, this bridge is really high. Look at all the water below us. Hey, is that a hamster ball behind us? I thought Sherman would have been at the school by now. That ball is coming at us fast. It's going to hit us. Ah! We're going down. I'm not sure if we will ever get out of here. Hey, Cosmo. What is Cardboard's favorite sport? What? Boxing. <laughs> ah! Grab on. I just finished a delivery. It's a good thing I flew by when I did. You saved our lives. Thank you so much. Anytime. I better get back to work now. You should stop walking so close to the edge of that bridge. I can't believe that hamster pushed us over the edge. First he captured the other robots in that box, and now this. 
We better get to the school quickly before he destroys it by filling it with slime. Okay, we're at the school. But now what? We have to find that slime machine before Sherman can turn it on. Since the off button is broken, there will be no way to stop it once it's on. <sighs> sir, sir, uh, can you help us? Sure, sure, what do you need? We're looking for a... Uh... Sorry, that's my phone alarm. Why won't it turn off? Let me just take the battery out. Sorry about that. Sometimes my phone just won't be quiet. You just gotta take the battery out. What were you saying? No problem. We're looking for a hamster. Have you seen one around here? Let me think. Um. Ah, I know of a teacher who has a pet snake in her class and another one who has a pet turtle. But I can't think of one who has a pet hamster. We're talking about a hamster that just came in the school a few minutes ago. I don't think I've seen one. Well, ah, I did see a ball rolling down in that direction. That could have been the hamster. Thank you very much, sir. Where are all the students? They're probably in class. Oh, yeah. Hey, look at that cracked door. That doesn't look like a classroom. Let's check it out. Oh, hey, Pip and Pop. You are too late. I already turned on the slime machine, and as you know, there is no way to turn it off. No! The machine is hooked up to the vent system, so slime will begin filling every classroom. You can stick around if you like, but I'm getting out of here before I'm covered in slime! Oh no! Oh no! Sherman did it! The school is going to be destroyed! Don't panic. We need to keep calm and just think. The off switch is broken. There's nothing we can do. I got it. Remember that man whose cell phone kept making noise? He took out the batteries to stop it. You're right. Maybe the slime machine has batteries. If we take out the batteries, it will turn off without the switch. We did it! We stopped the slime machine! We defeated Sherman's plan! Well, he still has the other robots trapped in that box. Oh, yeah. Let's go back and save them. Hey guys! I've been waiting for you! Sherman? Is that you in that mech suit? Yup! If the kids want a robot, I'll give them a robot! And since you stopped me from destroying the school, I'm going to destroy the house! Let's get out of here before he shoots us. Oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man. Oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man. Get a hold of yourself, Pop. We need to think. How can we defeat Sherman in that mech suit? I'm thinking. I'm thinking we should give up. We can't give up now. We've already made it this far. We already stopped Sherman from mailing the box he trapped the other robots in. We freed ourselves when Sherman trapped us in the net. We stopped Sherman from destroying the school. Now all we need to do is stop Sherman in that mech suit and free the other robots from the box. You're right, Pip. We can do this. Everyone has a weakness. We just need to figure out Sherman's. Huh, you're right. Deep down, everyone has the same needs. What do you mean needs? I'm talking about weaknesses. 
Sherman just wants a friend. We all do. I have you. Cosmo has Vector. Who does Sherman have? He just wanted to play with the kids. Is that so bad? Yes, it's bad if it means kidnapping robots and destroying the school. Besides, I don't think he's in the mood to talk about friendship right now. I have an idea, but it is very risky. I spy something dark. Everything is dark, Gio. It could be everything. You got it! It was everything! I'm starting to get worried, guys. I don't think my battery is going to last much longer. Stop! We have an ultimatum. What is it? Let's do a maze race. If we win, you will let the robots go and stop destroying the house. But if you win, we will voluntarily go into the box with the other robots, and you will be done with us robots for good. It's a deal! But just so you know, I've never lost a maze race. Are you two ready to start the race? I'm actually pretty excited. This maze looks really fun. It's been a while since I've had someone to race with. I'm ready! Wait a second. There is no way I'm fitting in this maze. Giving up already, huh? There we go. Now I'll fit. How did he do that? Didn't you notice I'm made of blocks? I can rearrange them. That's pretty cool. Well, let's race. I'll even give you a head start. On your mark, get set, go! <laughs> Well, it looks like you won, Sherman. Of course I did! Despite the fact that I now have to be trapped in a box and sent away forever, I actually had a good time. I wish we were able to do more races together. Really? I thought you wouldn't want to see me ever again! When you're not trying to kidnap us or push us off a bridge, I actually like being around you. I learned some good moves while watching you in that maze. Thanks! It doesn't have to be robots or pets, you know? What do you mean? It can be robots and pets. The kids could play with us at the same time. I'm sure if we asked the kids to let you join, they'd be happy to. You do that? Even after all I've done to you? Sure, the more the merrier. The only reason I did any of this was so I could get more time playing with the kids. Maybe I don't have to put you in the box with the others. But what about the others? Are you gonna let them free? I don't know. You may have forgiven me, but I don't think they will. Give them a shot. You can talk to them without letting them free. Okay. Robots? Is that Pop up there? It's Pip and Pop, and also Sherman. Watch out before he throws you in this box also. He's actually not a bad hamster. He was just lonely. Maybe you all would let him play with you and the kids. Can you forgive me for trapping you? Forgive you? I want to thank you. I've been recording this experience, and I just uploaded a video to my YouTube channel called 24 Hours in a Cardboard Box Challenge. It's gone viral. I've already gained three new subscribers. Sherman, why didn't you ask us to play before locking us up? I thought it was a robots only club. Of course you can play with us, Sherman. Really? Thanks. You guys are the best. Let's out and we can play right now. 
The kids will be home from school any minute now. I'm so glad to finally get the break from Gio. He's been so excited about his video. I had to subscribe to his channel with all three of my accounts just to get him to stop talking about it. Hi, robots! And Sherman! It looks like everybody's getting along. Piv and Pop, did you have fun meeting everybody? We sure did. At first, we had some issues with Sherman, but we worked it out. When you are playing with us, you should start letting Sherman play also. I thought Sherman was afraid of robots. I'd love to play with you all together. Thanks, guys! Let's be friends. Sherman, we talked about this. You have to stop destroying our house. Robots, we love you. You are the bestest thing. Wheels and lights and beeps and bites all the joy that you bring. If we had a flying pig, we would name it after you. We don't know if that's actually true, but that doesn't change our love for you. <laughs>